Hey what's up guys it's Ayan here back with another video and today I'm gonna show you something very special. So if you're wondering what I'm doing with this old Micromax Canvas 2 colors, you might be wondering I'm freaked out right? But if you go to XEO developers site, you will see more than 12 custom ROMs for a single device. That's a lot when it comes to a one device. Under the hood it is powered by 1.3 quad core processor of MediaTek and it has 4GB inbuilt memory. Nothing that special and it has 4.4.42 KitKat and red version. So I have used many custom rooms for this phone which may include clean cat, dark L and even the Cyanogen mode 5.1 which is the latest indeed and it's running on 5.1.1. But in spite of using all those room, I was never satisfied with the quality and all those bugs that were present on the phone. But after using MIUI 7 on this phone, I am quite satisfied with the custom room and it is very good indeed and has no bugs. It is very smooth and the app management is superb in this phone. So without any further ado, let's get started with the overall review of the room or that is MIUI 7 for Micromax Canvas 2 colors. If you go to settings, you will find that it is running on MIUI 7.2 stable version and it's 4.4.2 KitKat. One thing to be noted is that if you go to system updates, it will provide you the updates but Please don't update your phone as it's not an official phone of me or Xiaomi, your phone might get bricked. So don't you dare upgrade your phone. Uh, all other features are same as the MIUI and if you have used MIUI you might know those features but for those who don't know I'm telling in details. Okay, so Wi-Fi Bluetooth is working fine with this phone and there's no problem with call and reception. And there's also the theme fe feature which is quite unique when it comes to me devices and you can even change the bootloaders and other things from fonts to everything. And there's display settings, sound, lock screen, do not and it has the do not disturb mode which is quite good and advanced when it comes to Android. It has light mode. Light mode is for the old ones who don't want much complications in their phones. And there is a child mode. And if we go to additional settings, we will find there is privacy. And privacy, there is nothing very, very unique. And there is date and time, language settings, local, 100 mode. It's a very nifty feature. I'm going to tell you about that in the later part of the video. There's battery, there's storage and notification light which is of no use because it's two notification lights that is green and yellow, sorry green and red and there's the button features, accessibility, backpack and wrist and me mover which is a nifty feature again because it, you with this app you can clone one device from another or in other words you can replicate all your data from one phone to another. Okay. And it's all the same like new UI and it has no <laughs> app drawer. It's just like you slide this side, that side and that's all. And if you talk about the camera quality of the phone, if you talk about the camera quality of the phone, uh, I think it is still the same but the UI is very, is better and the camera clicking speed has increased a lot. So like I have a Samsung Galaxy Pocket Neo and let's try to click a photo of that sorry wait and now I'm gonna show the quality as you can see the quality of the camera is really really good and like if you can see it you can see even the uh, those cracks are also visible but nothing very special again so if you are using this phone and want a good custom room, I will suggest you to use this this ROM that is MIUI 7.2 stable version for this phone because it's really good in no doubt. So yeah, on the later part of the video I said you are going to show you the one-handed mode feature. This feature might be 
it see enter 100 mode and if you enter the 100 mode you can see if you get a small phone for a, for a year device and that's all so yeah if you see the 100 mode so yeah I'm back and if you see the 100 mode it's a very nifty feature for the ones who have small hands and it's a pretty big phone actually an average size phone that is 5 inch but nonetheless it's quite a nifty feature and may be useful so if you just tap here like 100 mode the 100 mode will disappear so thanks for watching this video hope you like this video and hope it helps if you are willing to install this room and you have already like flashed a recovery and want to flash a new room and wondering which room is per preferable I will suggest you to go for Mi UI 7 which is perfect indeed in my point of view links in the description down below for this room will be given and you will directly <laughs> supply the link of XDA developers so no point of any bugs or something thanks for watching this video hope you like this video and if you enjoy this video give a thumbs up give a thumbs up and subscribe our channel thank you